Welcome back to the land of frostback bears and a place where no one fucking cares. Well, we got a real special treat for you fuckers now. We're uh, going on a bit of a fucking race here. We got old Dirty D in here and this sassy fucking K-Whopper. What do you think, Dallas? I think we gotta get it done. This is fucking mint. We got, we got a long way to go and a... Uh, we don't know how to get there. We don't know how to get there? Yeah. All right. Anyhow, this is the fucking tour of what the fuck is going on. Nothing but organization though, eh? Hey, Dallas? We spend more time organizing in this shop than... Uh, yeah, everything's organized. Nothing, there's not one fucking tripping hazard in here. This shop is definitely handy, cripple accessible. But here's the fucking list. And uh, anyhow, we got a lot of shit we got to get done. So old Dallas here, he wheeled this, you bought this truck five years ago? Yeah. He bought this, it's a 1973 yeah. W9A. Okay. See, I know what I'm talking about. So, uh, so energetic, eh? I know you're just, you're just, you just, you, you turn it on for the camera. Yeah. All right, so he bought this fucking thing from uh, Sexsmith, eh? Sexsmith Oil Alberta. Oh yeah, he's making it happen. Sexsmith Oil Alberta. Uh, it had a fucking ca uh, Cummins in it. It was a tandem. It was fucking ready to give her. And he drove it from Sexsmith to Raw Crotch, and it blew up halfway in between. Who would have thought it wasn't air cooled, eh, Dallas? Yeah, yeah it's only a 50 mile air cooled engine. Yeah, we got piss jugs engaged. Yeah, but sure, exactly. So he went back, started her next morning, got her a little farther before she chucked the rod outside of the block and completely fucked it. And it's been sitting around ever since then. So about six months ago, he wheeled her into the fucking shop, gutted the fucking whole frame off. So he cut the frame right off. Right here. So we went at her with a dull apprentice and cut the fucking thing right off here. So she was a tandem with uh, dirty old axles, dirty old fucking bud wheels, this, that, and the other. Old twin sticks garage, you just sitting here yanking out of those greasy old fucking rims. I said, don't disturb you, I'm cleaning my room. He pulled the steer axle out of a newer truck and the fucking rear diff out of this truck. Might have had a bit of a fender bender. And by fender bender, I mean ripped the whole frame off and completely fiddle fuck the whole goddamn thing. All right, so after he was done fucking cutting the frame off, putting a newer front axle in it, newer rear axle in it, he gutted the mill out of it, put a fucking 8B what? 92. 92 in there. Just a giant Just pile of horsepower. Right now. Are you doing the carpentator? Yeah. Don't get the fucking rotor splint all kind of fuckulated. But he fucking put a 892 Detroit in here out of a fucking fire truck so she's got the heart of a fire truck so you know she's gonna give her and a four speed yeah four speed yeah. four speed allison bruce Turner. biggest fuck drive line in there from a1 drive line sean minty as fuck just a good guy and uh yeah after you got all that shit done you put the hydraulic or the transmission cooler on it had a bunch of shit mounted on and then i get a phone call he says uh and I hear someone crying and sobbing on the other end of the phone. And Man, I wonder if they all know you're full of shit. No, he, I'm never fucking bullshitting. Anyhow, he gives me a holler. He says, uh, Peg, I'm lost to know you. I've been jerking off to your pictures of you all night, and I want you to come help me work on my truck. So my fat ass got here, and well, I finger banged my belly button for about three hours. And we fucking got to work on the air system. We completely fucking redid the air system, him and I. This thing held air all fucking night. Everything in the dash works for the air. Everything works. It even has fucking brakes. We rigged up line lock. So when you fucking hold the, uh, your service pedal down, you're able to hit a button and completely get rid of the rear brakes. So you're gonna be able to turn these into smoke. Redid it with all new relays. Well, he completely fucking hacked you off the front relay on there, but we're not gonna talk about that. What the fuck else did we do? Oh, completely redid all the erectical. Show us what we're doing with the electrical here. I don't really know. Yeah, no, what well, we're learning. It might work. All of this, it needs all this kind of stuff to run. We've definitely let the smoke out of a couple wires. And your test leads, remember your test leads? That was you though. Remember how me? cool they were yesterday? Yeah. Well, they're not that cool anymore. They don't really work. Someone let the smoke out. Put all these batteries in here. We redid the fucking tail lights. Obviously the goddamn thing was cut off. The whole power system, so this is gonna be drag racing. So they gotta be able to kill the power when they come up to the truck. So yeah, we put all that fucking shit on there. He fucking put a hitch on it just in case we gotta, you know, in case the Dodge guy's truck break down and we gotta hook onto their gay pride float. Today is Tuesday. 
And we gotta be racing this truck on Sunday, is that correct? Right. This truck's never been driven. Other than yeah, other. It's it's only ever been in gear by itself and moving. That's it. It's never fucking we're really been. To, uh, we're about to fire, fire some up. up and send her to the moon. So fuck yeah, those test leads are fucked. We talked about this. It's just heat treated. Heat, heat treated fucking test leads. All right, well let's just fire it up. Just give her a little tickle on the fucking foot feed there. Oh yeah. Oh oh hold up. We forgot the fuel cell. Isn't this, isn't this, return. well that's return, oh we're good then. Yeah, we got the good fuel tank rigged up here. Definitely no dirt getting in there. get back to fucking work on so the, we weren't veggie taping before we, we've been working on this thing for about four or five days well i've been here four or five days wrenching on it and uh i never started veggie taping until we could kind of see light at the end of the tunnel so now that we know what we're doing we're just gonna fucking keep recording and make it look like we know what we're doing isn't that right dallas that's right so anyway we're gonna get gotta get the uh, exhaust on her we gotta get intake on her and the intake's gonna be just fucking sassy and we gotta maybe seal up. Man, we should just leave the hole in the back of the cab. It's gonna be hot out. We should make it removable, really. <laughs> well, frost backs aren't set up for this kind of the weather. Imagine the dirt that's gonna be flying in that hole down the highway. The dirt's fine. Oh. Yeah, but it's gonna be like a vacuum. It's not gonna get it, rid of the rat shit. It's the muskrat shit. Oh, nice lady there, Amy. Uh, this, she might have found a uh, a dead muskrat living in the dash of this thing. And uh, you know, you got mice turds, right? They're about this fucking big. Oh, right. Man, musky has been ripping off logs about that long and the whole dash is just filled yeah. all right the list is long and so are the days so uh we're gonna get her all give her all the way here check out this fucking tactical piss jug though all right just confabulating the exhaust here it's looking to be pr pretty solid there so she's gonna come off the fucking mill on a 45 or some kind of degree down here through there along the fucking frame rail here and she's gonna shit out right here. Right in people's fucking faces. I don't fucking know. Man, I don't know where anything is in this shop. You know why? Cause I haven't put anything away all week. That's your job. You don't need to use new hardware. Ugh. Hey, remember that time Mel Walkini fucking called us to sponsor us? Oh no, wait, they fucking suck. Their tools are good though. I didn't know you picked up David's Farm exhaust clamps. Check out that shit, eh? Looking fucking mint. We're able to turn her up. You know, blow smoke in people's faces. Or turn her down. Turn her down. And it'll fucking blow smoke away while you're doing a burnout. Minty as fuck. Now all I gotta do is uh, hook her from there. To there should be golden already so this fucking exhaust is damn near done all fucking old dallas has got to do is put a little smoke through her ready to engage smoke does a start, first start from in the cab and through the exhaust fire truck ish so this fucking thing here like, let's say if dallas has gone full retired and fucking dialed into the wall and he's dead so the fucking truck official had to be able to kill the truck from back here right you dead man looking just fucking 
can streamline with the fuel tank right there. Just so you know, this fuel tank is going to be a lot like the fucking toenails on my rubber foot. They're there just for show. We're going to strap her up and call her good. All right, well, I just got uh, cut all my hair mode off. One might say scalped. I made that joke at the thing and she laughed at it. Native lady and everything, Mindy as fuck. You know, everybody can get along just fine as long as we're making jokes, right? You're on some sort of watch list now. Am I on a, am I on a watch list? Yeah. Oh no. Might get fucking scalped for real. But anyhow, exhaust is all fucking mint. We got the straps all dialed in. This is gonna be polished up real nice. Or nice as Dallas gets it. Ask me if I'm polishing. Ask me if I'm polishing, Dallas. Why? No, I'm not. Fuck you. Um, the, uh, Intake is next. Got the, got the exhaust. Now we got to do intake. And this can look sassy as fuck. Right. Continuous duty ones. All right, some of that. And a little bit of that. And a little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at this. Look at that. And that and this. Turned into this beautiful fucking pile of air cleanerless fucking intake here. Look at that shit. You want to close the hood now? Was me in here? Yeah. How dare you? Me. K fucking whopper. Oh yeah. It's like from the land down under now. Alright, if you want to watch one of them channels where, you know, they put her into fast mode and then they put a fucking fancy little tune in the background. Well, you ain't gonna get that here because I don't know how to do that and I'm fucking stupid. Alright, but right now he's gonna fucking uh fire up the confuser and uh everything and see if it goes into gear. Oh man, did you put the supercharger on? Yeah, we put that it's big got, It's got a right supercharger on it. No, it's, from, it's, a, no, it's a supercharger. That's from Wyatt. We got it's, it out of the States. You know how I know this is a 92? It has a blower on it. Oh! Remember? Oh! Yeah. Ready? Oh, good. Turn, turn me on. Oh, you going to turn me on? Oh, look at the bald eagles firing out. pecker breasts and piss flaps we got a whole bunch of shit done since yesterday uh where the fuck did we start we got the god god gas tanks all dialed in ain't got no gas in it straps are all fucking done steps are on ask me if i'm gonna polish that ask me no fuck that shit all right the fucking mill's running mint i'm gonna bolt the computer down like you're seeing the fucking intake's done the uh i got a little steering set up the brakes on the front fucking seats are going in the old fucking relic Brand new K Whopper seats out of a fucking wreck. Just sassy as fuck. Just self leveling. Look at this shit. Hit the button once, they go down. Hit them again, they go up. And the more weight you put in the fucking thing, the higher they go up. Just billy fucking big rigging. Yeah, the back's all done. Got a wire in the tranny cooler. Bunch of other fucking shit. Uh, line lock, we got a wire up. Got to bolt this walking deck down. Got to bolt the fucking seats down. Oh, the seats are safe as fuck. They're, uh, they're going through the uh, rotten plywood there. So it's going to be good and safe. So we're going to have hot ass exhaust right here. Plywood that's rotten right there. All held together with muskrat shit. So it's going to be good. And if you don't believe me that uh, there's muskrat shit in this fucking thing, the whole dash was full of it. So you don't have to worry about muskrat shit. But yeah, and everything's fucking coming together. We're basically done. You don't need to worry about all the extra shit we haven't gotten done. But the list of fucking shit is getting scratched off. Every time we scratch one off, we add a new one, but the fucking way she goes. And we also got to build a, uh, a Bruce Jenner shit tower. What for Billy Big Rig in it Fast and the Furious style. So let's get the fuck back at her. Alrighty, so we're giving her all the way. We got Dallas hooking up all the fucking wires and shit. And see all those? What is that? 
You can't use this to, to cut wires off. Is that a Letterman fucking wave? Yeah. What a fucking beautiful piece of equipment. All right, well the fucking seats are bolted in there. Just Cadillac fucking seats. And now we gotta put a Bruce Jenner, uh plate in there. What for uh, holding the shift tower on. All right, well we got our half ass mocked up in there with the fucking wires running through the floor. Found center of the fucking thing. And it's bolted down. Now we gotta rig up the, uh, the tower to which the fucking uh, controller is gonna stand on. All right, and to do such, we're gonna use this piece of junk of Jackal. Jackal's rated for shifters, isn't it? It's mint. All righty. Well, this is our shift tower so far. Got the floor plate all dialed in like so. Got this fucker all dialed in for the uh, control box. Fucking Allison Tranny 500 shifter. Got a couple of holes there for switches. Now we're missing one fucking thing. Is a set of sassy fucking beer holders. Just fucking men. All right, after a long fucking my bald or sweaty fucking day. We got her all dialed in. All right, so let's go over the list. All right, we got Bruce deck tires on rims. Tires on rims are mint. Oh, we haven't put rims yet. No, blow by hoses. Cooler wires done. Tranny temp done. What the fuck else we got? We got a cap the cab and a headliner. Wheel nuts. Let's try them done. Uh, diaper we got to put on. Fluid check. Holy fuck. Man, look at this list. So we got like three things to do. You remember like a week ago how don't, much? Don't forget oh. this. Yeah, can't forget that. I know they're not forgetting it. You're hot. built here. Man, these 
already back from her fucking maiden voyage. So what we're gonna do is unhook the leveling valve right here and then let her come down right to the fucking bump stop so it's fucking spring on frame or whatever the fuck that is, top of the diff to the frame. And then we're gonna chain it across and then fucking boomer it tight so it's basically just diff on frame and then we'll see if it kills tires. All right. Now, you oh, no, finally went with my idea instead of the stupid wood. I'm glad you fucking thought of it. What are you, you new fucking for? lost are you, your plan. Are you a newfie or something? That's pretty good. We'll see what she says she's, after a bit of abuse. She's gonna go. Well, let's fucking do something about this chain. I don't think she's gonna want a dirty dangle the whole time. All right, well, we got the kidney blower outer 500 engaged. It's gonna be a good time. Traction control. DD speed shot? DD speed shot. What's that say on your shirt? Oh, Didi Speed Shop. Didi Speed Shop? Have, Didi Speed have Shop. you ever heard of Didi Speed Shop? Didi Speed Shop. Didi Speed Shop. Plus 10,000 views. Hashtag bots. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Are you having a jammer? What kind of cancer do you have this month? Hand Oh, the hand We might actually have the hand -to You got Donaire Bifida. Oh, it just dials right the Oh, it's just fucking beautiful. Hey, if it doesn't work out, we can go full 1996. Oh, man. Fucking man, it just fucking destroys tires. You don't need to worry about fucking tires. Holy fuck, I need to rock the fuck out of this piss. Oh, look at the fucking, it's just spoggy out right now. That's definitely not smoke. Oh, you Americans got to take your weather back. It's fucking killing us frostbacks. there mongos and mouth breathers look at all this minty fucking shit you guys are sending oh just fucking mint today is uh i think it's july 12th the vid you just watched was us building that fucking thing old muskrat we built her and then uh the day after that so we had her done that friday uh saturday uh dallas had to finish her up on saturday meanwhile while i was at home uh catching up on a few things with the old lady if you know what i mean then we drove down Sunday night. So Sunday night we drove the truck down to the the Miles of Mayhem races. So this was the fucking video of us building the old hoor. And now uh, just wait a few more. Well, I should have the next videos done in the next couple days. So enjoy the fuck out of this one. Enjoy the fuck out of those. Crack over about 3,500 of those fucking things. And uh, enjoy the shit that's uh, about to come. Appreciate the fuck out of all you guys. Appreciate the fuck out of all the shit you guys sending me. And more than fuck anything i appreciate all these fucking minty fucking patreons already well i'm a new fucking patreons from uh june 17th to meow well as i can fucking figure it out of the god patreon i'm so fucking stunned on the fucking computer um the problem is a lot of minty fucking pricks have been editing their pledge from like five bucks to ten bucks in hopes of me giving a fucking shout out and i would absolutely fucking love for that to fucking happen but it doesn't I, it doesn't show up on a list i don't know how to fucking do the filters so the best advice I give to you, if you still want to f shout out for my fat ass, f off and then come back and then it'll it'll f give me a, a, a notification say a new Patreon showed up. And basically what that'll do is it'll say uh, old uh, Slick Dick McFucktard is, is here for 10 bucks again. And then it'll give you, it'll put you on the list and then I'll be able to f give you the shout out that, uh, that you deserve because 
I don't know how to run Patreon for fucking shit. So I uh, appreciate that. But to these motherfuckers, 10 bucks. Tyler, Maywell Lutzen, Byron Dubois, Dubois, uh, I'm fucking stupid. 20 bucks. Tony Nichols, Logan Doyle, Liam Webster, David K. Ruff, Colin Ward, and Anthony, Anthony, Anthony LaMama. I'm fucking stunned. I've been drinking for like a week and a half straight, literally. So, uh, and I'm off the beers. Had a bit of the shakes today, no big deal. So, uh, yeah, give me a fucking break. 30 bucks. We got Joy Moat, Bluey Burnout, minty as fuck name. 60 bucks. We got a Hunter, Hundy fucking buck. Fucks. We got the the Kebler. And for a uh, hundred dollars Norwegian dollars, I just Google it, and a hundred dollars Norwegian currency is uh, fourteen cents Canadian. Here and here, I thought our dollar was beat to sh. And that goes out to uh, Jonathan Lund, L U N D H. He minty fucking pricks. Appreciate the fuck out of you guys. You guys are minty as all fuck. Thank you. Thanks again for keeping uh, free speech uh, paid for and free, or whatever the fuck you want to say, and uh, keep sh out your ass thing flying away in the fucking oil bird of wind oh and if i fucking missed anybody send me a fucking she mail i sent uh i replied to a whole fuck load of she mails there last time i did this fucking riggins and uh well i apologize but i'll try to make it up to you